caffeine is a substance that's naturally present in the leaves, seeds, and fruits of many plants, where it acts as an herbicide and insect repellent. It's naturally found in tea leaves, cocoa beans, coffee beans, guarana, and cola nuts. In addition, people add it to a variety of foods and drinks, including ice cream and energy bars. A primer on caffeine. Caffeine is the most commonly consumed psychostimulant substance in the world. The term psychostimulant means that it increases the activity of the nervous system. The Food and Drug Administration generally recognizes caffeine as safe. Consuming up to 400 mg of caffeine per day has not been associated with adverse health effects in healthy. However, studies have observed mixed results, and some people may experience negative side effects at intakes of less than 400 mg per day. These side effects include heart palpitations, anxiety, insomnia, and increased blood pressure and heart rate. Because manufacturers add caffeine to some foods and drinks to promote increased energy, alertness, and mood, you may be consuming more caffeine than you think. Coffee Coffee is a brewed beverage prepared from coffee beans, which are a natural source of caffeine. Revered for its taste and aroma around the world, coffee is consumed for its stimulating effects, which increase energy levels, mood, and alertness. Whether coffee increases the risk of disease is controversial. Some studies exploring the relationship between coffee consumption and the risk of disease have suggested an increased risk of heart disease, while others have shown potential health benefits, including a reduced risk of type 2 diabetes. Cocoa beans and chocolate. Just like coffee beans, cocoa beans naturally contain caffeine. This means that all chocolate and foods flavored with chocolate contain some caffeine, but the amount of caffeine in the product depends on the percentage of cocoa it contains. Cocoa also contains compounds like flavanols and methylxanthines, and some studies have investigated its potential as a functional food. These compounds, including caffeine, have antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties and may provide health benefits. That's good news for chocolate lovers. Green tea. Another natural source of caffeine is green tea. It's an especially popular drink in Asian countries. Green tea contains amino acids like thenine, which studies have shown act on the hippocampus in the brain and exert stress-reducing effects in animals and humans. A 2017 study further suggested that the combination of thenine and caffeine in green tea may improve brain function and cognition, as well as reduce anxiety, although more research is needed. The caffeine content of green tea varies by the age of the leaf. Older leaves provide less caffeine than younger leaves. Chewing gum. Chewing gum is a soft, rubbery substance traditionally made from tree sap. It's not a natural source of caffeine, but manufacturers may include caffeine in their recipes. This has made chewing gum popular among some athletes and others looking for an energy boost. Studies have shown that you absorb the caffeine in chewing gum much faster than caffeine in capsule form. This is possible because the buccal mucosa cells of the inner cheek absorb it quickly. Chewing gum that contains caffeine may increase your alertness and attention span. Certain caffeinated versions, such as run gum, provide 50 mg of caffeine in two pieces of gum. Energy drinks. Energy drinks are carbonated. Sweetened beverages marketed for their ability to boost energy levels, mood, and alertness. However, energy drinks are sold as food supplements, not regulated by the FDA and exempt from rigorous testing. Therefore, it may be difficult to determine the caffeine content of some brands. One study indicated that the caffeine content of energy drinks ranges from about 50 505 mg. In addition to caffeine, energy drinks contain taurine, an amino acid that is naturally found in the brain and possesses antioxidant properties. Chocolate-flavored foods. Because cocoa beans are a natural source of caffeine, all chocolate and chocolate-flavored foods and drinks contain caffeine. The amount of caffeine present depends upon the amount of cocoa the product contains. That's it for today. Check out the channel for more health and weight loss content. You can also purchase our weight loss course. And please, like and subscribe to be notified of our next tip. See you next time.